Hello friends, software from companies like Adobe, Microsoft and others can be quite pricey especially those with monthly yearly fees that can add up over time. In this video I will show you guys alternatives to those popular programs, and as an added bonus we'll even show you free alternatives to Windows and Mac OS near the end of this video all of that, and more coming up on Tech Talk 101 SD. Microsoft 365 which includes their Office programs Word Excel and PowerPoint is very popular, but having to pay for other services you'll probably never use is overkill at this time Microsoft 365 is the most popular for creating or editing various types of documents. For this category we have two free alternatives for you first, of which is LibreOffice with alternatives for Microsoft Word Excel and PowerPoint it's compatible with Microsoft Office file types it lets you open Office documents edit them, and you can even save your documents in a format that can be read by people that use Office another one of our favorites that's been gaining popularity over the last couple of years is only Office just like LibreOffice only Office includes compatibility with the popular Microsoft Office formats in addition only Office allows for real-time collaboration with others which is handy if you're working in a team environment. If you're looking for image editing software Adobe Photoshop is the most well-known and feature-packed it comes with a steep cost. The best free alternative to Photoshop is GIMP it features and free tool set allowing you to do everything Photoshop can, but there is a high learning curve, but includes professional level tools that allow you to work with layers manipulate colors add gradients and a whole lot more. If you're someone who's a digital painter another free Photoshop alternative is Krita it's feature packed as well with over 100 brushes stabilizers and also allows you to work with layers. Adobe Lightroom is for those people focused on photography its features help you to organize edit and store your photos Lightroom's cost is just around $10 per month but is overpriced for what it does. Darktable is the best free alternative to Lightroom with a ton of features to improve a photographer's workflow unlike or Photoshop which are raster graphics editors Darktable allows for non-destructive editing keeping the original image data until finalized it also includes tools to keep your Images organized and easily searched by parameters. Using virtualization software like VMware is a great way to try out other operating systems and software in a sandbox without doing harm to your primary system. VMware Workstation for Windows and Linux is one of the most popular with hectic pricing, and for Mac OS the name of VMware's product is called Fusion. The pricing for this also big. Best free alternative for VMware Workstation and Fusion is VirtualBox it's available for all three of the major platforms Windows, Linux and Mac, while they do provide a user manual it can be quite difficult for newbies to get started they do have a beginner's guide for VirtualBox as well that will help you out using Linux as an example, but you can use just about any operating system that you want. If you're looking for high-quality video editing software you have many choices Final Cut Vegas Pro and Adobe Premiere Pro are a few of the most popular. Using Premiere Pro as an example it lets you work with any file format add transitions and special effects and edit on unlimited tracks the pricing for Premiere Pro and others are quite high. Comparable free alternative to Premiere Pro Final Cut and Vegas Pro is DaVinci Resolve it offers multi-cam support transitions color and audio correction along with everything else you would need to edit and trim your videos in addition DaVinci Resolve is also a great free alternative to Adobe. After Effects it lets you create high quality visual effects and motion graphics, they have two versions available DaVinci Resolve and DaVinci Resolve Studio DaVinci Resolve is the free one it includes just about every feature you probably ever need when working. With scalable vector graphics create logos icons or any other type of professional quality vectors Adobe Illustrator is what many people use. The best free alternative to Illustrator for creating vector graphics is Inkscape it includes a ton of features for object creation and manipulation these can be filled with solid colors radial or linear color gradients and patterns all of which are compliant with the SVG format Inkscape does. Have a steep learning curve thankfully they do have tutorials on their site that will teach you how to use it. There are a ton of free screen recorders available, but you have to be careful, what you choose most like bandy cam will slap a nasty watermark on your recording. The best free screen recording alternative to snag it is Ob Studio. After you get it set up it's easy to use, and includes a number of useful features to record and stream on such places as Twitch, YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook their community forum is a great place to get help with any of your issues, and if you're just getting started you've also got an OBS Studio. Beginner's Guide that will help you.
Now if you're into 3D modeling Maya from Autodesk has long been the industry standard for 3D computer graphics it's been used for video games animated films TV shows and movies it's not cheap. But by far the best free alternative to Maya for creating 3D computer graphics is Blender it's been around a long time its initial release was way back in 1994 and has been free and open source the entire time Blender is no slouch with many users saying it's now better than Maya it has just about. Every feature and tool you would ever need, and has been used to make full-length animated films, when you get started check out their support page which includes a user manual tutorials and links to the various communities associated with Blender. Adobe Audition is yet another overpriced product from Adobe the software is a multi-track audio recorder mixer and editor that's becoming more popular with podcasters. Best free alternative audio editor to Audition is Audacity it's been around since the year 2000, and quite frankly it's so good that there really is no need to use a paid product like Audition with Audacity, you can record audio import edit and combine sound files, remove noise includes hundreds of effects and you can install plugins to enhance its functionality. If you need a video converter to compress or convert into a supported file format there are a bunch of paid ones to choose from including Unit Converter from Wondershare. A great free alternative to those paid video converters is Handbrake we've been using it for years and it fits all of our needs it supports most of the popular codecs such as H264, H265 AVC and others the built-in presets make it really easy to convert any file type and export up to 4K you can. Also customize the output by altering the bitrate maximum file size or bitrate and sample rate via constant quality. Also this is great for compressing videos without losing the quality. Now for bonus category the most important software on your computer is the operating system and if you're looking for the best free alternative to Windows and OS you'd want to go with one of the many Linux distros the big advantages to using Linux is there are no upfront or built-in costs to use. It no forced updates invasion of your privacy, and you have less of a chance of getting a virus or malware. If you are brand new to Linux those I'd recommend for beginners include Linux Mint Ubuntu Zorin OS and Elementary OS. Many Linux distros will ask for a donation on their homepage to support development which is not necessary, but appreciated for example with Elementary OS. If you want to kick the tires first go to pay what you want, and in custom type 0.00, and then click on download elementary OS and you can get it for free thanks for watching all links are in the description if this video is useful for you give it a thumbs up and share with others if you know of any awesome free alternatives to expensive software not mentioned let us know about them in the comments and if you're new to our channel subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss out on the latest free software and other tech related stuff here on tech talk 101 sd